Yes, let's talk about last song about uh, UMK. I realized I can actually li- read the whole lyrics from um, Voice Populi. But if you go back to UVisionWorld.com poll, you have the whole lyrics. And if you're watching on, on the phone, you can translate it on here with from Finnish to my case English. English. So you can, if you want to read all the lyrics from UMK, you can just press English and then you have the whole lyrics. And if you read Voice Populi's song, it's a very heavily, it's a very deep lyric, if you ask me. So anyway, we have one left and that is Cine Subotage with Kurumi, kur, kurimua, which is peel me. Let's de- dive in into the lyrics in a second, but let's let's make sure I can see the song and listen to the song. So let's see, Cine Subotage with peel me. Glam, my darling. She looks glamorous. Heal me, heal me. Oh wow, I, I'm expecting a show stopping performance from you, darling. I need that swan thingy. Okay, kind of now. Oh. Stop the song. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna say this feels like a little bit by, you know, hey, um, the dance song from last time with Kai Kira, Kai Kira. Uh, business on the dance floor. It feels like we are in that kind of lane of songs, and it feels so. This song feels so different from all the UMK songs so far. It's not wrong with the song. I'm gonna say it's a very dance poppy song. She feels like the Finnish version of Kylie Minogue mixed with a little bit more of section of Madonna. If you look in the music video, it feels like about Kylie Minogue featuring Madonna. So. Oh yeah, I need that golden swan uh, swing thing on the stage. She can do so much with this music video with the staging. Why do I feel the songs and music videos are so sexual? Girl, you need to bring it on the staging with this one. Oh lord. The thing is that this song could be better if this chorus was stronger. Because this song is a bop. The song is a bop. But I feel like this song could have been a little bit stronger when it comes to the chorus. If you ask me, I hope she brings it live. Oh, this part is nice. The instrumental is nice here. Yes, uh, Cine Sabotage. I mean, you have the everything in the music video for perfect staging. This is so kind of me now. If the year was was two thousand, I mean, I gotta say, if the year were two thousand, this song would have killed the original staging. I mean, 
this song is a little bit sexual if you read the lyrics. I mean, well, is this the chorus? When she dips in the chorus, undress, oh, peel me, peel me, feeling like a cherry cake every talking day. Cherry on the top, yeah, thanks for the comments. These layers are kind of heavy. I'm dressed up in everyone's opinion. Surrounded by this non stop mayhem, unbox me right here and now. Okay, let's dip, dip, dip. Deep, deep, I'm ready. Open my onion. Okay. Undress me, grab me by the hips, peel me like an onion, get ready for the dumb tears. Undress me, dive into my core, peel me like an onion. I got layers. Girl, if this song is a little bit too sexual, then. Oh, girl. Uh, yeah. I mean, you can read the whole lyrics. This song unbox me right here and right now. Ooh. Undress me, undress. I mean, this song is very sexual if you read the lyrics in English. Um, CC, I'm seeing it, the blue onion. Don't we all pretend that everything is fine? Life ain't nothing but work and stress. Everything busy is the biggest flex. Party all night looking for a new mommy. Some flesh and blood. Every time, everyone hates trauma. Oh, open up my onions so we can have fun. Skip the small talk. When you're gone. When are you going to therapy? You have, oof, I can't, la I cannot read the last part, but go into Eurovisionwall.com and press English and read the whole lyrics. This song is, ooh, girl, this song is steamy. If you read the lyrics, um, yeah, I mean, this song, if this was 2000, would have won Eurovision. This song, if this was 2001, 2000, 2001, back, I gotta say, from 2000 to 2008. If this song came then, this will have won Eurovision easy. This is such a kind of, you know, bop. But this is 2024, and I think this song can do well if they revamp the chorus to make it a little bit stronger, because this is a very 2000 song. But girl, this was a steamy song, so I'm here for it. Anyway, let's see what she is on the polls. Uh, no, not you. I'm not talking about you at the moment. Let's see. Don't work with me here. Work with me here. Can something work for once? Let's see. Where is she? She is number four on the poll. Okay. I mean, I can say if she nails the staging, she can finish top two. Because this is a very, very easy song to catch on to. It has a nice hook. But I'm worried that since when I read the lyrics and when I saw the video, this can be a little bit over-sexualized. That can turn people off to vote for this. Because we all saw what happened in Norway's national selection with Milo, but that was a completely different story. He might have the voice, he might have the song, but the, the vote performance might scare people off. Because what's a little bit scary, if she does the opposite and makes this too, too sexual... That might turn people off as well. So this is a very th fine line on where she's going. So anyway, me Stine Sabotage. You have a fun song to talk about. And I'm all here for it. So thank you. <laughs>